Uh, definitely one to watch out for. But now, the Royal National Life Boot Institution is a charity which saves lives, and we at Blue Peter are very proud to have had a long association with them. We've raised money to uh, buy both boats and rescue equipment through our appeals, and it was in a boat like this one, the Blue Peter 4, that a rescue took place last October off the North Cornish coast in St Agnes in Cornwall. Now, this rescue was of two surfers, one of whom was a 12-year-old girl. It was headed up by the helm Gavin and his two crew members Rory and Jamie. In this reconstruction, Gavin tells the story. Um, the day we, we were out on exercise, just launching with the, the rescue helicopter, but uh, we had an immediate call to go to a place called Chapel Port, which faces uh, due west into the, Atl the Atlantic swell. And that day there was a heavy swell running on the west coast, on the north coast. So we um, made our way down to the cave and we found two people clinging onto the edge. Um, as we made a turn in there, two other surfers aided to try and rescue these people, but they all got washed into the cave. Um, with the heavy surf breaking in there, uh, I, made, I managed to, to sort of position the boat off the cave mouth, and then between the set waves breaking, I managed to reverse the boat right into the cave. Um, it's a tricky manoeuvre, it's very not easy to do. Um, it's very, very, you know, a lot of patience, a lot of timing. And we got into there with the, the training and what, everything, the skill we learned, what we do, and it, you know, it paid off that day. Wow, quick thinking on Gavin's part. Now, Rory and Jamie, you were the crewmen. How did you get the surfers on board the boat? Well, we uh, shouted up them to uh, jump in the sea, and uh, they uh, jumped in, and uh, they, they jumped a, a metre off the uh, shore straight into the sea water. Oh, so they missed. Yeah, there was, a, there was a kind of a brief moment of panic, but when myself and Jamie kind of leant over the side, pulled the girl out, and then uh, managed to get the guy in, and we managed to get out safely. Oh, well, it was successful indeed, and you all got medals uh, to say a big thank you. Now, you might have noticed that uh, Gavin's got a Gold B Peter badge for a rescue that he did ten years ago, uh, but you two have saved lives. So in an unprecedented moment of TV history, I'm giving away two <laughs> gold badges to you both, so you can pop those with your medals. Yeah, thank, thank you very much. Yes. No, well, it's very, very commendable work. And not only that, but you actually volunteer for the RNLI, don't you? It's not a paid job, so you've got day jobs as well, haven't you? Yes, uh, I'm a, a bench joiner. Are you a bench joiner? So you might have joined a seat much like this one here, and then you get the call and you have to just drop everything? That's right. I mean, you could be at home, I don't know, making a cucumber sandwich, and the next thing you know, your pager goes off and you've got to get down the hill. And you've got to rush to it and get in your gear. That's right. Which makes me think, <laughs> it's time for a Blue Peter challenge. Come on! Come on <laughs> up we get and off we go. So we're going to team up now. Uh, Gavin, you can help me yep. by doing the judging and the commentating. OK. And we've got our two teams point. with Matt and Zoe. Yes. Uh, so what we want you to do in this challenge is to get into the kit as quick as possible. Can we have a clock on the screen, please? This is going to be great. Got it there. And okay. you hang, on, hang on, hang on, yeah. hang on. So, teams, so oh, Matt's oh, getting his shoes off. off. OK, so, <laughs> on your marks, get set, go. Oh, we're off. And they <laughs> are off. OK. Oh, a flying start there from our two crew members. So there they oh, he's going, he's going. Oh, oh my <laughs> word. Look at that, and we've got water. to make no, that going fine. Going fine. authentic. <laughs> Matt is dripping wet. Oh, there we go. It's a realistic <laughs> effort here. And meanwhile, Jamie and Rory, they're nearly ready to save lives. Yeah. Um, Rory's there. So Zoe's lagging a little bit there. Yeah. <laughs> get her head through the head hole and dripping wet as well. <laughs> Meanwhile, it's helm well, on there for well. Jamie. He's doing very well and he's going to help his crew member, Matt, uh, in a real uh, show of camaraderie, I think. Meanwhile, uh, Rory is also close. helping out Zoe. Very close. And time is ticking past. It's kind of neck and neck, but I think Zoe... <laughs> might... Oh! Zoe! Zoe! Ah, rescued! Right. I've been rescued. Yes. There we go. And your prize, oh, I'm dripping wet. <laughs> Behind me in the queue for the barbecue. Oh, oh I'm so sorry.